the reason why Ephra has a Jamestown. Your papa, no, our brother is here to give us the full detail, or the full history, why this place is not named by a gun man, but rather the name is uh, Jamestown. My brother, please, your name. Actually, my name is Nick Paco. Nick Paco. Nick Paco from Jamestown. Okay. And this is the oldest part of Accra. This is Jamestown. We have so many monuments in Jamestown. Something like the lighthouse, fishing community, and the fort, that's for James. Used as a slave activities, and after they stopped the slavery, turn it as a prison. And Ghana Fish, Prime Minister, Osage Food Dr. Kwame Nkrumah, was in jail there for two years. So inside there, we have a slave marketing. Female prison and a male prison all inside there. And also, the reason why we got the name Jamestown, I'm going to sell the slave to Mr. James. Is that I'm, I'm going to sell the slave to Mr. James. That's why we had the name Jamestown. Okay. Our chief sold their own people to the slave masters. That's why we had the name Jamestown here. Yeah. And also that's why we have the British Palace. That's English in Alatamanche Palace. Jamestown, British, Accra. We have an old man there with a picture, 99 years old. Passed away two years ago. He's the paramount chief that we have in Accra. And that was the first ice street in Ghana. By this to Nigeria to go this way. Ivory Coast this way. Also having the first hotel in Ghana, that CV hotel. When slave masters are tired, they used to arrive and have their cold beers. We have a slave tunnel from the Yellowish building. The slaves have to walk underground from there to the fort, from the fort to the point of no return for the slaves. So you see the reason why we had the name Jamestown here, right? Our chiefs sold their own people to the slave masters. And Ghana is the first Africa country to get independent. When Nkrumah was out and Ghana got independent in 1957. So Ghana was the first Africa country to get independent. We speak Ga here. This is the Ga community. We speak Ga. But the trees and the LS Togos Nigerians live together here. Yeah. So do we still have underground? Yes, yeah, still the tunnel is there. It's there. But can we pass under? Do you can pass under there. Wow. You can pass under there. It's a tunnel. That says the slaves passed from there to the Is it forest. something big or it's just a narrow? Big, something big. 3,000 to 4,000 people were there. Wow. Yeah. OK, so but why do you then have these Chinese people, their logo and all OK, everything? nice question. Down here used to be the first port and harbor that we have by the British. Eight to nine months ago, government moved everyone from there, giving the land to the Chinese to build a fishing harbor. So the fishing harbor is there. And when a job like this coming to Jamestown, boys here will get a job to do because no jobs here. No jobs in Jamestown. So when the government is bringing job to the community, we, 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 we like it and we enjoy it to work. Because youth are a, a lot here. 17,000 population live in Jamestown. Yeah, so if there's no job, and job is coming to Jamestown. You, okay, you, so you, my yeah. final question. What are some of the things that Jamestown, you guys want here that up to now you haven't gotten? Something like jobs. When jobs are here, main, main job here is fiction, boxing, Fiction, boxing, and, and, and music, that's the talent that we have here. But when more jobs are coming here, we'll be glad to do that. Like the fishing harbor. Okay. Girls and women will get jobs to do here. So where is the fishing harbor exactly? Down there. Down there. Yeah, down there. Okay. okay. Thank you very much okay. for your Thank time. You. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> so, guys, um, your phone... <laughs> Uh, this is a uh, history that, as an African, Ghanani, uh, Ghananu, Ganyu, we need to know. A lot of things has happened here. Our chiefs have sold their own people to the slave masters. Yes, still, now we are in, as someone said, we are in uh, mental slavery. Our leaders, our president, our uh, leaders are yes to. So uh, selling our properties to the Chinese people and the other uh, foreign uh, investors and foreign country. And so we as an Africans, we need to 
you know, rise up and fight for our rights. And no one says, So please, if today is your first time watching, Thank you.